and hello everyone welcome back to some more Pokemon Black and White 2 this is LP Elite Gamer and last time we were in the Pokemon Studios we just explored a little bit in Pokemon Studios and uh, this time Mr. Studios is uh, actually asking us to be part of the movie so all we have to do is accept and then uh, we're just gonna move on so anyways uh, we've done exploring really much um, with Pokemon Studios the only thing we're going to do now is uh, make our own movie we're going to Hollywood, baby. We're going to Hollywood. We're going to be famous. We're going to make millions of dollars. We're going to buy a little house in Hollywood. So anyways, um, yeah, even reading the conversation between those two trainers, basically, uh, you have to rent Pokemon first before you can actually use your own Pokemon. Which is kind of sad in, in the beginning, but, um, you know, in the, at least you're learning something before you're using your Pokemon. So he gives you like a tutorial about um, actually how the system works and um, it's pretty easy basically okay the script is very important and basically the script is what makes the movie of course so um, okay also written in the script you can look at it while shooting so you can check if you're in trouble the script you can shoot increase depending on things like the content of the movies you have made or how much they have crossed, grossed hey do you want to know anything about Pokemon Star? okay so like I said he's gonna give us a lot of information about the Pokemon Star which is gonna be very helpful for us okay at first we have we have you read Pokemon for your scripts okay once you make a good film you'll be able to shoot it again with your own Pokemon so pretty much um at Pokemon Star Studios, any Pokemon can participate in the filming, but you need to pay attention to the moves it knows. If a Pokemon knows any of these moves, it cannot be in the movie. Okay, Transform, Torment, and last, not least, or Metronome. Can make sense. These movie moves are in your Pokemon Star way, okay, so they are banned. So. I guess I'm fine for now. We're going to do our studios, we're going to do our best. Let's see if we can on top. And as you can see here, apparently there's something green, so most likely the green screen. So that's be this is gonna be cool. Our own movie. Welcome to the sound stage of the Pokestar Studios. We'd like to try to shoot a film. Shoot a film. Okay, so let's try party Pokemon. Okay, it's like, like the other guy said, we cannot use our first Pokemon. We have to actually rent Pokemon before we can use our own Pokemon. Okay. Okay, then let's start to shoot. So he's going to rent us a Pokemon. I'm not sure which one yet. But it could be any Pokemon. Okay. Three, two, one, action. Alright, so we're filming right now, so everyone be quiet. Okay, so look at this. The cameras are rolling on you and movie star Bryson. So basically this is similar to a battle, Pokemon battle, seems like it. And we have Ralio. Oh, that's cool. So okay, we're going to the first scene and um, we gotta check the script. Okay, the plot. I hear a battle of the masked man who is targeting the amusement park. Knock out an opponent every scene. Okay, so we're doing basically the same scene as um, the captain. Use a move dark type is weak to. And then scene two, use a flying type is weak to. So we have Barnyard who knows Brick Break and Arrow Ace. So we got we actually gotta move use a move in order to um, Defeat Barnyard. So we have Force Palm and Ice Punch. Well, basically, the obvious choice is Ice Punch. Just kidding, Force Palm. So Barnyard is defeated one hit KO. Okay, that's it. Good job, Ralio. Too bad you're not my team. The next Pokemon is Full, ba full Baby. Oh, Full Baby. So, um, 
you will get down on your knees before me when I end you with my dark secret art. Prepare to be finished. Okay, um, so we have two options to choose from. So let's say bring it on. Okay, so now we're going to scene two. I can see they're working for an outline. So obviously uh, the scenario is going to be um, we got to use a flying type um, use a move flying type is weak to. Obviously, we have Ice Punch. So, Ice Punch should do it. So, he uses Faint Attack. And, you know, the funny thing about when we watched the movie with Captain, um, this Pokemon uses uh, Aerial Ace or something. Which defeated Raleo. And this time, he used Faint Attack. So, that's interesting. So anyways, Fuller Baby is fainted. Uh, that might not be bad. Of course I'm bad. I'm a professional here. I know what I'm doing. So, basically that's how the Pokemon Studios work. Fine work everyone. Filming is done. So that's it. So all they have to do is now editing and that's it. Good work on the shoot. Would you like to release the film you just shot in the theater? Yes, of course. So in order to do this, we have to save first. So we got Growly, Shock You, Squishy, and we got Alkaiser. I haven't really trained them, but um, I guess since I was kind of busy, but they will be trained very soon. But well, obviously they're kind of over at this moment, so I don't want to train them too much. Okay, that was staring acting, but this is where we are really amazing. The movie you just filmed. We will be finished in an instant and released on the silver screen. Wow. They're faster than anyone else. Come on, Elite Darling. Let's be off to the theater. Hey, boss. Sorry to interrupt. But the time. Oh, no. Oh, that's right. Got it. So, apparently, the boss can't see us on the big screen. Well, Elite, you should go see how you be turned out. Of course. I'm sure it will be an amazing movie. You are in it, after all. Ciao, see you again soon. Pokestar Studios is always waiting for you, Elite. So he's off and we're going to the big screen. We're going to check out our own movie. I bet I will get a contract very soon. And before we do that, I just want to check some places out. Okay, so this is kind of big. And we have an empty stand with a nice, very nice view. I was being sarcastic, but um. Okay, so I guess it's time to go before we head off. Well, now, I like to see a love story like just like ours. Oh, how romantic! Hey, darling, what are we going to do to watch today? Every, today. So those look like um. Kofurius? Looks like it. Anyways, let's go back to the movie theater and um, yes, let's check out our own movie. I can't wait. Of course, we have to go to the receptionist. So let's watch a movie. Come on. So it has Bryson Man versus Raleigh Kid and... Hold on one second, okay. I guess this is our movie. Okay, it's time to begin. It's time to watch our movie and, and um, become famous. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's do this. Bryson Man, the Royal Oak first Bryson Man. Applies of never ending smiles. Okay. So basically the same intro. So I gotta be quiet.
Bravo, bravo. This is gonna be one of the best movie ever. I'm definitely gonna be number one in America. Well, well, if it isn't elite, darling. This particular effort turned out to be a spectacular hit, darling. Keep it up and you'll be loved by movie buffs everywhere and our staff. Bye now for now, Elite. I'm so looking forward to your next picture. So if we keep continuing with these movies, the staff will love us. And that's important because the staff is important. So anyways, we finished uh, making a movie. We became a hit. We're number one in America right now. So what we're going to be doing now is that it's time for us to go. It's time for us um, to speak with the captain and hopefully we'll go to a different city. So, um, what's this? That's um, Team Plasma, if I can remember. We have Roxy, our rival, having steering contest. So let's put our, um, you know what? Growl is fine. Okay, let's do this. Let's do the steering contest too. I can win. Okay, um, that's right, we're Team Plasma. Team Plasma's back. Two years ago, we were betrayed by, our, by the man we respect as our king and hero. So our conquest of Unova, Unova region ended in failure. However, we'll never give up. We'll preserve fair. We already have another plan in motion. Shut it. You guys are the worst. You talk about saving Pokemon, but you're just Pokemon thieves. You see it. Don't think I'll ever forgive you. In the ranch, we got chased by Lillipop. Not Lillipop, was hurt her. And now we're getting involved in trouble. This kind of stinks. Well, is it okay? Isn't it? If we steal their Pokemon. Okay, kiddos. When you're ready, give it, it your best shot. Alright, so we're going to do one on one each. And this is going to be amazing because we got Growly on our side. And nothing is happening. What? Think you can beat me? Haha, your Pokemon will be helping us take over the world in a few seconds. Alright, Team Plasma. Okay, so um, apparently we mixed the Team Plasma soundtrack. And honestly, I'm not a huge fan of it so far. Um, I like the normal black and white one uh, Team Plasma soundtrack. The remix is okay, but I prefer the other one. Anyways, Patrick's gonna use a. Uh, keep going on with. Oh no, not that attack. Come on, Rally. Good job. So, one more Rock Smash, that should finish him off. And this is, that should finish off Team Plasma. Super effective, yes. Good job, Growly. Plasma, I lost. This is awful. Of course, it's awful. I'm the best. Just kidding, not yet. I can't believe kids like these caught off us off guard. We kids are strong. Let's run. So they pushed me. How rude. What a bunch of creeps. Split up. You go check Route 20. And she comes like, if I lost my precious Pokemon would have been taken. That's true. We're gym leader. You're supposed to take on these bad guys. They use this. So we obtained HM01 which is cut. So we obtained our first HM and um, this is definitely going to be very useful. Which means we're going to need an HM Slave very soon. So, um, Pokemon and Oka can use it even when they're not um, in battle to cut down small trees. But more importantly, let's go after Team Plasma. Come on, we're splitting up and searching Route 20. So we gotta go back to Route 20, find Team Plasma. But you know what? Forget this. I'm going on the boat. 
and the captain's not here, so let's go to round 20, I guess. Yeah, so Team Plasma is back in Pokemon Black and White 2. And as you can see, there's a bubble in the water, which is in hidden Pokemon. But I, as I was saying, um, Team Plasma is back. We know in the Pokemon Black and White 1, it was the main character versus N. Both characters were um, the heroes. So I wonder what happened to Sekrum and Reshiram. So now we're gonna look for Team Plasma. Where could it be? So we got a rival right there. And Team Plasma is right there. So let's go really up. Maybe there's something else. If we talk to him, let's see. Help me check Route 20, okay? Okay, so apparently there is nothing else left except for that one Team Plasma member. So I guess we're going to the Team Plasma member, checking them out. And let's defeat her. Let's do this. Alright, so Team Plasma is defeated and now, if I run this way, no one can help me. I have to head towards the ocean. So with that in mind, I'm going to flee again. Goodbye, Furbank City. And I guess that's it. Team Plasma has left again. Well, they're running good at running anyway. She says just something useful. They must be moving around by boat. Castelia City has a big port. I wonder if they're heading there. Okay, let's go back to Furbank and look for someone who look like they know a lot about ships. So okay, so apparently our, our next city is going to be Castelia City. And as you guys remember, Castelia City is a uh, home of the third gym leader, Berg. So I guess our third gym leader is Berg. And we have a wild Pokemon. And we got a little small path rat. Well, Pathra could be a good uh, HM Pokemon. But I'm not sure if I won't really want to capture him. So let's run away and go back to Furbank City. Yeah, so, um, so definitely we're going, going to uh, Castilia City. And Castilia City is a huge city to explore. Definitely we can find new Pokemons, new team members. A lot of stuff. Okay, so we're going back to um, the captain. Because as you guys remember, he's the captain and he knows a lot about ships. So hopefully, hopefully he'll bring us to Castilia City. And there we have a daughter-father moment again. I thought your movie was pretty good. That's very optimistic. So, you saw it. The, that movie was... No, it wasn't a movie. It was me. I was so excited that I didn't really became, become Rollo Man. Acting like that won't thrill or excite anyone. Come on, don't get down. You can keep trying while you continue as a, on a, as a captain. As long as you don't cause any, anyone trouble. I won't get mad. I don't know how I feel... Uh, I don't know how the Pokestar... Oh, never mind. So apparently she caught us hearing the, uh, the father-daughter conversation. But the good news is Team Plasma's gone. We defeated the second gym leader. And now it's time for Castilla City. So come on, the captain. We gotta go. Okay, I guess I'll do my best as a captain. I thrill everyone by barreling through rough waves. You do that, Captain. So let's go inside and hopefully he'll bring us to Castilia City. Yes, I'm going there. 
and our rivals going there as well and he can forgive our uh, Team Plasma. And it's time to go and we have a small cutscene. It's pretty cool. Just look at the boat. So I wonder, oh never mind, I wonder if there um, going to be any battles or anything else. But here you get a, a nice view of Castilla City. Which is actually based, uh, which is based on New York, I believe. So now we're in Castilla City, and um, it looks exactly the same as we as in Pokemon Black and White One. So this okay, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna find Team Plasma, no matter where they run. Oh yeah, Elite. Here, let's register each other in X transceiver number. We didn't need to in Aspertius, but we could see each other um, all the time. That's a strange ship. A sailing ship in these days and age? Okay, so that could be Team Plasma's ship or someone else. It kind of looks like Team Plasma. Unless it brings us to a different city. Yeah, scream at the ocean, scream at towards it. Actually, going on the beach is very relaxing. Especially going on to the ocean, swim a little bit, relax. That's why a lot of people like enjoy going to the beaches, because it really helps you relax. So welcome to Castilia City. It is the Castilia Harlequin Hunt. I bet this is your first visit to Castilia City. That's great. Here, have this bicycle. Whoa, a free bicycle? For going to another city? How great is that? I bet he saw my movie, that's why. Okay, the Castilia Harlan uh, hunt rules are simple. All you have to do is visit the specific places and talk to the Harlequin there. Where you participate is up to you. The places to look are the metal office, the passenger analytics HQ, and the battle company. Ride the bicycle I gave you and go, go, go! So this is a huge city and uh, there's a lot of stuff you can do in the city and there's a lot of places you can explore. And um, the first thing, well, the first thing I want to see is basically the bicycle, how, how it goes like. Because I know maybe they change the mechanics or whatever. So let's use it real quick. And it's pretty fast. It's wonderful how the Pokemon and women here are so full of life. So this is the Battle Company and the Battle Company consists of so many trainers and you fight. But honestly, I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet for this battle and um, to be very honest, I'm not sure where you should explore first because this isn't, like I said, this isn't a huge town and we can explore many places. But let's go to this area and I knew it. Where did I put those sunglasses? Ah, I found them. And you really got to have more light to see your way by. Take this, it'll help you see in dark places. So we received TM70 which is flash and if you guys remember a TM fla a flash or it used to be an HM in the, the first generation. And second too. And maybe third? I um, can't remember. So anyway, there's actually one part I really want to see. And which is um you know Route 4. I know they have changed Route 4 a lot. And uh, I just I'm just curious to see it. Check it out. I guess after uh, Route 4 we'll we will go back and explore Castilla City. And hold on, who, who we got here? Hey, it's Bianca. When I saw you in the city, I just had to catch up with you. Take this, this is a dowsing machine. And the dowsing machine is very useful because it helps us find hidden items. You can use a dowsing machine to find places where items are hidden. It's exciting to find an item while looking for a Pokemon. Oh, good luck. Thank you. 
If you often use a dozen machines, the habits of lists and so on, why don't you register them? I think it's written in this book. Okay, I found it. So she's gonna read us. You can use the register item just by pressing the Y button. See? Okay, bye. So Bianca gives us a lot of hip hints and tips. Anyways, I just want to check this place out. Apparently we have um, trainers. I hope not. No. Oh, trainer, when you see sand, do you notice how some areas are lighter? Okay. Pokemon hidden dark scent. So I remember in Pokemon Black and White 1, this place was still construction and it was all sand. Now apparently, and we have here a fire type Pokemon, which is the Darumaka. Unfortunately, I already have a Growly, so no thanks. But it's an interesting Pokemon and it's a good choice to have. And in this desert, you can find different Pokemons. But I will cover it another time. But I just want to check out this area and, um, you know, I saw enough. So let's go back to Castilla City and we have a trainer battle. So let's do this. Okay, so let's go back and um, what I really want to do next is explore Castelia City. Because there's many different items you can find in the city. And basically, we have to fight against the third gym leader before we can do anything around a four. So anyways, I'm going to end this video right here. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, next time we'll explore Castelia City. More in details, find hidden items, go to the Bella Company. And we're going to try to fight... Um, the third gym leader. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.